In other news, tension remains high at Sarmach village in West Pokot County after one person was gunned down and three others left sustaining serious injuries following a suspected banditry attack on Saturday. West Pokot Governor John Lanyangapu has condemned the attack and called beef, beefing up of security along the West Pokot Turkana border. On Saturday, bandits suspected to be from the neighboring Turkana County attacked herders at a grazing field near Malmata River along the West Pokot and Turkana counties, killing one man. <laughs> Three other people, 35 year old Limanyang Ro, his 12 year old son Simon Limanyang, and an 8 year old boy Armstrong Rock, are lucky to be alive but nursing serious injuries at Kapenguria County Referral Hospital. 20 year old man uh, with a gunshot wound that went through the chest, uh, and another one uh, on the right upper limb. Uh, so that one uh, we declared him uh, dead on arrival. Uh, the second guy was uh, this young man who also suffered a gunshot wound to the left upper limb. Uh, he's lucky by 22 and through. Uh, he did not uh, get any fracture, uh, but he lost a lot of blood. During the attack, hundreds of livestock were driven away by the suspected bandits as tension remains high in the area. We we'll move very fast with speed. We we'll are going to stop and order. We we'll let the security surveillance. We have officers who are going to be at the border. We are going to be able to do the work. Very dedicated officers. West Pokot Governor John Lenyangapuo condemned the incident, calling on security organs to increase security along the border. The incident comes a week after gunmen sprayed a vehicle with bullets at Kainuk area, leaving eight passengers and a Matatu driver hospitalized. Accurate resolution ni kufanya msako Kenya msima, Mondoe, Munduki, Nasila, Ramu, Mkono, Yaraya. Ben Chumba, Lunchtime News.